Hi guys, welcome to my channel Soil and Margaritas. My name is Roxana and I am so glad that you're here. So it's September and there is a lot to do in the garden. I have to make sure that all of my perennials and shrubs in my containers are taken care of for the rest of the year, that they're going to be moved into their permanent homes. Um, but also I have to do some pruning and some planting, mainly about boxwoods. I prune my boxwoods twice a year uh, one in the early spring and another one right before the fall. So uh, right now it's the perfect time for me to go out there and just give, it, give them a little bit of TLC. So that's mostly what this video is going to be about. Uh, I have a huge project going on where I need to plant a row of boxwoods on the back, on the backyard. So uh, I'm going to show you how I'm going to be doing that. Also I have boxwood hedges um, all over. So I'm just going to give them a little bit of love today so that they're good for the winter. And uh, that's it, you guys. So, so glad you're here.
that was a lot of pruning you guys that was a lot of pruning um, I think I'm gonna call it good as far as pruning my boxwoods today because it looks like it could rain although the weather this morning didn't say that I don't know so um, I'm going to be I don't know if you can see it there I'm going to be planting those boxwoods I have this uh, idea in my mind that I want a sitting area uh, with like a little center table slash fire pit uh, for next year that's not gonna happen this year probably but that was the reason why we moved that red battery or my husband did um, because it was going to be right in the middle I changed my mind on what I wanted to do with the back jar and uh, the red one was just going to be right in the middle so um, I'm hopefully the rain holds a little bit I'm gonna show you uh, how I'm gonna plant those and then uh, I can show you the finish sort of project gosh I'm so sweaty I don't know how to look good you guys while gardening <laughs> Okay, excuse me, I'm about uh, to put my first boxwood in the ground, but let me show you. I wanted to show you the roots on this thing. See how they're like coming out of the container? What I'm doing is, I'm not even going to try to get it off in one piece. What I'm going to do, okay, so what I'm going to do is that I'm using a very, very sharp knife, first of all, make sure that uh, you don't cut yourself. And then I just went and uh, make a line here and I'm going to try I'm going to try to get the whole plant like this. See the roots? This thing needed to be in the ground five months ago. So now, look at these roots. I mean, they are not holding any water. They're not, they're not at their best, you guys. So what I'm going to do in this case is that I'm going to just make several cuts here. See that? Trying to loosen up the roots. So they can start going. Oh my goodness, this is horrible. Just wild to me. I mean, and I know they're all like that, so I'm gonna have a lot, a lot of work in front of me. Which is okay. I'm not complaining, but <sighs> next step. There we go. I know it feels like I'm butchering the plant, but it's going to help it. It's going to help it kind of go easier, trying to reach for other, <sighs> other way. So.
So I am done. Um, I was going to clean up a little bit around it, but it's about to rain. So I am just going to quickly show you how it looks like. I love, love boxwoods. And when I put them as hedges together, oh, I just, I just love them. So this is how they look like. Um, the roots were really, really um, bad, but hopefully, hopefully I didn't do, um, hopefully they don't take long to establish here. I'm going to um, wait and see how much water we get and then I'm going to water them later properly. But um, so far I'm just loving how they look like and I think these are going to look great. Looking perfect. So that's it, you guys. I hope that uh, you enjoy this video. Give it a like. Maybe consider subscribing. And until the next video.